fifty dollars from McFly. Girlfriend and I started to stream a couple months ago. I was hoping I'd get some tips and followers. We have a decent amount of unique viewers per stream, but we're still short of follows for affiliate. Let me take a look at your stream. Let me take a look. So you guys are playing. I don't know what is I I I know what Dead by Daylight is, but what is GTFO? Is that a game? Guys, I understand it means get the F out. I'm saying I've never heard of that. That's a video game? So it's a horror game. So you guys are playing horror games. That's what I see here. You played Among Us, Fall Guys, Resident Evil, Dead by Daylight, Phasmophobia, and GTFO. Well, like, I, is that... For a while there, people were growing in Dead by Daylight for a while, right? I think Dead by Daylight is a pretty solid game to grow in. Yo, that guy. Jesus Christ. He hunts for a while. So, so whose screen am I looking at? Hopefully that counted. Okay. It's I mean, their overlay is not bad, right? Oh, it says it's on McFly. Oh, smart. And it's whoever that's on. That's pretty good too. Honestly, the, I mean, so like your overlays and stuff are pretty solid. Do you guys have a schedule? It's like five hours, three hours shots. The only thing I can think of is you are moving around games a lot. And I've always said to people, bro, growing in, trying to grow as variety is really hard, man. I grew in one game and then I started doing variety when I got bigger. It's up to you though, man. You know what I mean? I appreciate your 50. I don't know. I, I can't really give tips, bro. I've been doing this for so long now. You know what I mean? But I mean, look at someone like, I can use like XQC as an example, right? XQC really grew in Overwatch, right? Some people may not even know that. But that's kind of like the first game that he really streamed a lot. And then he went variety and he's crushing it. You know what I mean? Tim, you're wearing a shirt? Yeah. <clears throat> Thanks for your 50, McFly. Good luck with it, bro. Hey, Tim, I know you hate self-promo, but I just started doing live streams. I got a pretty exciting W yesterday. Can you check it out? Is this what happens when I click one self promo link? There's a team that. that oh, oh, shoot. No. Yes, no. Stay in the gas. Not in the open. They're on no, top what of the do you want station. me to do? I can't. You really should play the loadout box. Hide behind They're that. On top of the fire station. You should play the loadout box. It's one person for each team right now. Yeah. On top of fire right station? Then they're firing. Just, just play it out. Just There's out. no way they're top fire. It's in the gas. Taco. And put or, your... Yeah. Sniper, sniper right there. What? How's that <clears> possible? Sniper, you got this right there. Fuck. Let's go, sniper. Oh! oh how, how does this guy that what? you're fighting right here, lose this gunfight. How? Th bro, this guy has you on a heady? He has you on a heady? You are wide in the open and he lost that fight. I need lobbies like this, man. Oh my God, I'll drop a hundred kills. You guys, chat, you say I suck, bro, but then I see some of the clips of lobbies that... Uh, um, unbelievable, bro. Tim, that's where you belong? Oh, please, bro, come on. You owe me more respect than that, chat. Hey, congrats on the win, Caleb. Thank you for your 40. I cannot believe that that guy let you win that fight. Hey, Tim, a while ago, I asked for your blessing to get the Bleagle tattooed. I didn't get it but I plan to get one later. You wanna see what I got on my hand? Look at my Instagram. There's no way that you're not giving me the link right there, right? You're gonna make me look up your Instagram? Guys, what are we doing today with Donos, huh? Give me the link. I don't wanna, I, I don't wanna have to search and then what photo is it? How do I know which picture it is? Tim, you're lazy? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> $25, I'm just laughing because there was a teacher that I had in high school that sh she called me lazy. She said that I was one of the laziest people she'd ever seen. You're not wrong. You know what I mean?
but she her whole motivation behind calling me lazy was she, she was basically saying uh she wanted me she was like i want to see you get somewhere in life tim that's kind of what she that was her goal and um here i am lazy as ever you know what i mean so i guess some things happen for a reason chat you know what i'm saying some things happen for a reason you know what's whip spamming you want to know the worst part about the dude that donoed not only did he not link the picture but his instagram is also private chat, what are we doing today are you guys okay are you guys hung over today <laughs> today today chat's hung over oh he did it he did it he did it that looks cool actually that actually looks really cool i like it bro i like the way that it lays it goes up your arm pretty well the wings and stuff it looks cool man i like it i like uh i'm a big fan of like for me personally with my hand tattoos i was either gonna get roses or i was gonna get like a bear or something you know what i mean bro looks cool man i like it thank you for your one-on-one guys i got a new bottle okay i got a new bottle no more $150 Yeti bottle, okay? I got this one. I don't know why this is the color. Um, I thought it was a different color, but whatever. Uh, but the reason that I wanted this bottle is because look at this, ready? The other one was really heavy and it, and it was hard. So like, watch this one. And it has like a marker on like, good morning, good evening, good afternoon. Hydrate yourself. Remember your goal. Keep chugging. Feel awesome. Don't give up. Almost finished. You did it. 9 p.m. And then, see, close this, dude. Not as heavy. I can drink it way easier, bro. How much was that one? That one was about $1,000. <laughs> It was like a tenth of a television, so I figured that was a pretty good deal for a for a gallon jug. <laughs> I have to pee. I'll be right back. Hang on. <laughs> I have to pee. <laughs> I always sucked at math. You know one thing my math teacher always used to say to me? What do you think, Tim? You're gonna always have a calculator with you? Look at me now. Everyone has one on their phone. Who's the real idiot? <clears throat> oh, let's move on, chat. Where am I? 25 from Jimmy. Hey, Tim, I'm a wildlife researcher. Here's a picture of me with hundreds of little Kevins. Oh my God, there's penguins everywhere. Look at all these penguins, dude. Kevin, your friends. You want to know what's kind of weird? Thank you for your 25, by the way, Jimmy. You want to know what's kind of weird? It's almost like there was a prophecy of me and penguins when I was younger. When I was in fifth grade, I'll never forget this, bro. There was a, all of the fifth graders had to do a research project in fifth grade. That was the big thing that you had to do. It took like half the year. You know, you're a fifth grader. When I was in fifth grade, like when I was in fourth grade, all the fifth graders were talking about it. Like, oh my gosh, dude, this is so hard. I have to, I have to have three sources. And so I, w I made it to fifth grade. I did. And I was like, and everyone's picking topics. And like, just so you guys understand this project, like it was, it was like you had, uh, what are those poster boards? Anyone remember? There's like three of them. It was like, you have one, two, three, and you have like things like hung up on them. You know what I'm talking about? Anyone? It's like a, yeah, a trifold. So you have pictures and shit. And so, <laughs> so everyone's picking all of these topics. One girl. I think she picked like, uh, it was like the flu or something. And my teacher, sh she was like, you guys can pick any topic you want that you can do research on anything at all. And so we're all going around and finally she gets to me. She goes, Timmy, what do you want to do your, your big project on? And I looked around and I thought for a minute and I said, penguins. <laughs> and I did my fifth grade research project on penguins and i still remember some things about it because <laughs> i still remember some things because 
there was like variations of penguins and one of them lived in Africa. And I think that really confused me because I thought that, um, I thought the penguins only lived in cold weather. I didn't realize they could also live in warmer climates. I think it was called like the macaroni penguin or something like that, bro. But it was funny. I, I, did, I did my fifth grade research project on penguins. They had, there was like a bunch of different penguins. I did, I, yeah, I did, uh, I, so I did my research project uh, in fifth grade on penguins. And um, I think I got a D, but you know, you know what they always say, boys, D's get degrees. So you're a dumbass. Yeah. There's only ever been one class through my life that was um, easy for me. Every other class that I did was hard. It was really hard. Chemistry, hard. Math, hard. English, reading, hard. There was one, okay, lunch. Are you guys serious, bro? That's rude, okay. Okay, actually there were two classes that kind of came naturally to me. One was gym, and that's just because I'm a fucking athlete, dude. Literally, look at my body. Look at that, dude. Look at that tight, dude. I haven't lifted weight in years. I'm literally an athlete. So, like, gym, you know, I crushed it. Although I sucked at the mile. I hated it. But, chat, I will literally, I will take all of you to school. Anything you want. Any sport, bro. Badminton? Don't care. I'll kick your ass. I'll learn how to play tennis. I don't care. I'm an athlete, bro. So gym was pretty easy for me. Um, but the other one that was really easy for me, uh, the other class, public speaking. That was one, that was one class. It was just mad easy for me. And my, my teacher, I remember she was like, Tim, you'd better have a career in public speaking when you're older. And I said, okay, Re realistically, I'm just talking to a camera. But like, there's a lot of you on the other end of this camera. It's pretty crazy. You know, it's kind of crazy too, bro. I, I did, when I was in college, I did a, uh, I did like a, a presentation on esports as well. That was one of my, cause it was kind of up and coming a little bit with like Halo and stuff when I was younger. <sighs> Tim, get, go get a job at Taco Bell. We don't have to like bring up past hurt, right? Come on guys.